from the top floor of Manio High School, live on tape, it's Manio Today with Kelsey Sexton and Kyle Logan. Your weekend weather with Logan Marshall and MHS Sports with Janae Julian. Good morning. Today is Friday, April 13th, 2018. I'm Kelsey Sexton. And I'm Kyle Logan with Manio Today. Would you please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now, a moment of silence. Prom ticket sales will end today at 1 p.m. Life Touch will be offering four exciting picture opportunities this year for prom night. They will be taking pictures outside on the pier from 6.30 to 8. It's on a first-come, first-served basis. There will be the traditional pictures inside with a formal backdrop from 8.30 to 11.30 p.m. Also, new this year, a selfie station with free unlimited text and emails from images from 8.30 to 11.30. This week, leading up to the prom, SAB has had many planned activities for each day. Priority will be the mock car crash in front of the school during IT for the juniors and seniors. Stop texting and driving. It's not for you. For me. Good things are happening here at MHS. Congratulations to Junior Carson Kreef for his acceptance into Project Uplift at UNC Chapel Hill. Kreef will spend two days on UNC's campus where he will experience the academic rigor and social climate of the university. Good things are happening here at MHS. Ms. Summerall's first period Spanish 1 and Ms. Cecil's techniques for success classes practice verb phrases by playing the memory game. The students created the game cards and practiced their English and Spanish while testing their memory skills. Good morning. It finally looks like the weekend will start out very spring-like. Looking at our current temperatures, you can see they are already in the 50s and the water temperatures are in the 50s in Duck and in Nags Head. So today, nice and sunny with a high near 80 degrees. Tonight, clear skies and it's gonna drop down into the 60s. Tomorrow, sunny and warming up again around 80. Saturday night, a great night to be out on Jeanette's Pier for prom. Sunday, rain returns along with possible thunderstorms and the temperatures are going to fall. On Monday, partly cloudy with a high in the mid 60s. Have a great weekend. If you're going to the prom, have a great time. Coming up today, Seniors, the Jostens rep will be here with cap and gown deliveries during all lunches. If you still owe money for your cap and gown, the balance must be paid before you will receive your order. Coming up tomorrow, the ACT will be given here at MHS beginning at 7.30 a.m. Congratulations to the chorus students Liz Hodgson, Jesse Granger, and McKenna Williamson who will be traveling to the All-State Chorus in Raleigh. The prom is tomorrow night at Jeanette's Pier from 8.30 until 11.30. This reminder is if you are going to the after prom party. You must be there by 1 a.m., and if you leave, your wristband will be cut and you will not be able to return. If you are interested in being a part of SGA next year, please pick up an application in the Guidance Office. Completed applications and recommendations are due back to the Guidance Office or Ms. Pritchard by Friday, April 27th. Thanks, Kelsey. Yesterday, the ladies' soccer team had a home game with Hatteras. Let's check the scores. Coming up today, the soccer team has an away game at Hertford County. They have a 145 dismissal. The varsity baseball and varsity softball teams have games at Camden. They will leave after school. Good luck to Miss Witter, who will be running on Monday in this year's Boston Marathon. Bring home the gold. Corbin Brown, a junior golfer, accepts a set of new Callaway golf clubs and a personalized golf bag purchased with proceeds from the 2018 Anthony Golf Grant. Brown will also receive two golf lessons from the Duck Woods Golf Professional staff as part of the grant. It is awarded annually by the Duck Woods Country Club. 
Over the spring break, Coach Sawyer and several of the football coaching staff went to Clemson University for a coaching clinic run by the Clemson Tigers football coaches. It's Thursday, and you know what that means. Throwback Thursday. Mom, do we have Dr. Pepper? No, sorry. Aw, but I do have some Sprite. Okay. Ew, gross! Okay, it is bad. Let's go get some. Thanks, Mom. Aw, oh, thanks, Mom. Here. Bye, Dr. Pepper, Pepper today. today. Time to find out what's cooking in the kitchen with Miss Gail. Wrapping up the week, we have the four cheese pizza, chicken cheese flatbread, the half baked potato, buried green beans, and the frosty peach cup. Thanks, Miss Gail. That's Manny today. And for Logan Marshall, I'm Kyle Logan. And for Janae Julian, I'm Kelsey Sexton. Have a great weekend and stay safe. And we'll see you back here on Monday morning.